Guess what? My umbrella just dried off, and I'm about to have to get it back out again. <laughs> yeah, Isn't at least we can wait through most of the weekend, though. <laughs> yeah, okay. So we can so enjoy. So we can get a good weekend. A yeah, that's, that's right. Good. Rounding out the week, heading into the weekend for a lot of kiddos. Maybe one of the last real weekends <laughs> of summer. Hard to believe Clock's school starts in a week or two. Yeah. <laughs> I know. I know. Let's take a look at the sunshine. We are actually uh, watching a couple of days ago some guys out there practicing for football. I mean, you know, football is just around the corner after all. Bright blue skies up there in Marion County as we shift gears to Etowah. County, the other corner of our viewing area, Gadsden, seeing a full supply of sunshine right now. Beautiful day on the river. Temperature sitting at 87 degrees. A little bit more muggy up towards Gadsden right now, where those dew points in the low 70s going to make things feel just slightly more sticky outside. Some drier air for others, making it feel a bit more pleasant outside. But we'll take it. 86 in Coleman, late July, not bad. 91 in Birmingham, a little warmer as we head south. 93 now in Tuscaloosa with 90 in Moundville. But a dry scan across all of central Alabama have just a couple of passing clouds. No rain on tap, but as I zoom out, here's what's really controlling our weather right now an area of low pressure down to our southeast. That's providing some rainfall from the panhandle of Florida all the way up towards the Carolinas. But for us, because we're on the back side of this low, it's reinforcing that drier air. Winds are out of the north. But let me move out of the way and you can see some rainfall back to our west. This will be the next rain. Maker. Now, for us, there is a very slight chance of a I have an isolated shower tomorrow, but better rain chances as we move into next week. But let's talk temperatures tonight. We're looking at those low to mid 80s through now to 9 p.m. and then sliding into the 70s right around midnight tonight with overnight lows settling at around 70 degrees. Dry, mostly clear. It's comfy out there. It's kind of a windows down kind of a night if you're driving around this evening. And then as you wake up tomorrow morning, again, right around 70. But I do want to point out that little boundary that's going to push in early tomorrow morning could squeeze out a raindrop or two back to our northwest at around 11 a.m. tomorrow. But keep in mind, the majority of us stay dry. So I'm not even really putting rain in the forecast. I'm just going to verbally mention we could see a sporadic shower. I think the heaviest rainfall stays in Mississippi and an isolated pocket of rain possible through the afternoon. 90s south of 20 tomorrow. Temperatures in the upper 80s to our north. So another warm day on tap, but we are going to continue seeing sunshine through your Saturday. Stray showers Sunday, but it's Sunday night really into next week where things get quite unsettled. And that's a look at your storm teams.